once again, it's your boy, Red Milwaukee 414, coming back at it again, straight from Sneakers Color Line. Uh, today, this is actually another review. Like I said, if you guys checked out my last video, I'm actually um, doing a couple videos today, uh, making up time for a couple Funko releases that I picked up within the last two weeks that I just haven't had enough time um, to actually do a review on and actually uh, release them. So I'm actually, you know, I got a little bit of time today, so I'm actually trying to bang out, pause, <laughs> All these videos, not all of them, because I won't have enough time to do all of them, but a couple Funko pickups that I actually was able to get or that actually came in, finally came in pre-orders or just what I found or new releases um, that I picked up within the last two weeks. So um, today with this review that I'm doing right now, you guys seen the thumbnail, you guys know what it is. I actually finally got this pre-order right here that came in. Um, and this came in from Big Pop Shop. So, uh, shout out to Big Pop Shop. You know, I, I, this is another pre-order that I did months ago. Months ago. And it finally came in. Um, I won't do a M3 Toys rant about this pre-order. And I'm still on the campaign about not doing any more pre-orders ever again when it comes to Funko. But this was actually one of my last pre-orders that I did months ago. Like, if this is February, I did this back in June. So, June 2018, and this is now February 2019, and I'm just now getting it. That's eight months. Eight months. So, you guys can probably figure out how I'm feeling about this right now. But you know what? It's all good. Because um, the two pops that I have in here that came in... I already opened it up, but I haven't looked at him yet, really. Um, you know, like, I'm excited that I got them, but at the same time, I actually saw these in retail stores, maybe like with these past, maybe like a, over a month. So I knew that they were out. But I, I know the name of the game when it comes to Funko though. Like, they are, you know, like they ship out to all the, you know, the, the, the big shops first, and they hit all the low tier shops you know, like glass, bottom of the barrel, like glass, you know, so anyway, that's why, that's why I say I'm probably not going to do any more pre-orders because they take forever to ship to the mom and pop stores compared to all the big store, Barnes and Nobles and different things like that or whatever, Think Geek and all them. So that's why I'm saying I'll never do like a, a pre-order again, just because probably get it in the store faster. But anyway, I, I've been talking long enough. Let's go ahead and get into it once again. Shout out to Big Pop Shop. And I have here finally. Don't want to show my information here, but they shipped it basically just like this. Right here with this small little bubble wrap. That little mess. That's what they that's what they shipped it with. But I have no complaints on their shipping because the pops came in amazing. And as you guys can see there, you got the gold chrome Ant-Man and the gold chrome Black Panther. God damn! So, we'll start with gold chrome Ant-Man number 384. So that's Marvel Pops right there. Gold chrome Ant-Man 384. And then number 383, Black Panther. So I'm really excited about these two pops right here. Like I said, I've been waiting for eight months to get these and they finally came in. Uh, I, I think that they look amazing. They do, they really look amazing here. That's Marvel Studios, first 10 years on top as usual. Artwork on the side, transparent opposite side. And as usual, the half head on top. And then they have all the characters on the back. So, and do they actually, yeah, they have, they have Ant-Man and Black Panther on the bottom, which are actually the last two out of this series that I needed. So I actually have the whole, I actually have everybody now. Yeah, I actually have everybody that's uh, with this series right here. So I have the whole collection, finally of the gold chrome. So I'm done, finally. So um, stay tuned for that. I'll probably do a whole collection video of the gold chrome pops. Um, but we have here Black Panther. I'll go ahead and open this one up so we can check it out. Because I haven't checked it out like out of the box yet. So 
Hope everybody's having a good day today. And this Black Panther with all the rest of the gold chromes is a bobblehead. So you want to handle it with care when you're dealing with these gold chromes. And most definitely, I wouldn't display these outside the box because if you drop it or if they fall or anything like that, they it, it will get scratched up. I mean, you know, the uh, it's a gold chrome um, figure and like the, the paint on here is, it really isn't all that. It's very shiny, but it is not all that. It will instantly scratch up. So the details on it is really dope. Uh, with the mask, it's uniform, showing off his claws, uh, which are actually pretty pointy. Uh, claws on feet also as well that are actually pretty pointy. And as you guys can see, like I said, he is a bobblehead. And I know y'all can hear that. So, here's the back of him. Y'all can see the details on his, on his mask, on his helmet and everything. This one is fire, man. Like this one is really, really dope. I'm, I'm very excited and glad that I was, that just finally came in. Um, but most definitely, when I saw this as a pre-order way back in the summertime, it was an instant cop. I had to have it. So out of all of them, out of all the gold chromes, I was most excited about this one right here. So um, I don't know how much um, these two are valued at right now. I really don't care, um, to be honest with you. Like this one right here was very much a must cop, and I'm very glad I got it. So out of all of them, I would think that this one is probably the most valuable one. It probably isn't. But in my opinion, I think it, it should be. So um, y'all let me know what y'all think about Black Panther Gold Chrome. Let's go ahead and check out Ant-Man real quick here. So once again, 384 Ant-Man Gold Chrome. Transparent side. Artwork on the opposite side. And half head on top. And then I didn't show the back, but there's the back showing all the characters. Go ahead and take it out the box real quick. Right, let's see here. There we go. Because I don't want to take too much time. And we have here, dang. Ant Man got a big head. <laughs> there we go, Ant Man. This one is dope, man. This one is really dope. This one is this one is huge. This one is like incredible Hulk huge um, in the body and the helmet. Um, the details on this one is, is crazy. I think this one is probably has the most detail out of all the gold chromes uh, from his helmet, um, from his uh, uniform, everything. The details on this one is crazy. All gold chrome. Once again, I would handle these with, cut, with care. Uh, make sure that you do not drop them because once you do that it will be damaged. It will be scratched up um, There's the back hoping that you guys can see the details on the back of his uniform uh, the side of his helmet uh, The front once again Other side of his helmet and Then the top there and as you guys can see once again, he's a bobblehead as well head big in the mug man this one is dope man this one is dope to be honest with you between between black panther and ant-man i don't know which one <laughs> now i'm kind of conflicted like between the two like i was very excited about black panther and ant-man also as well i'm a huge fan of both and i i mean i'm very much i'm satisfied man like i'm really satisfied between both of them both of them are really good. I, I This one is crazy, man. This one is really crazy. So I'm not going to hold y'all up, um, man. So y'all let me know what y'all think about Ant-Man and Black Panther. So which one do y'all like better? Do y'all like Black Panther better? Do y'all like Ant-Man better? Or if y'all like both the same, let me know in the comment section. Um, me personally, I can't choose between two of them. At first, I was like Black Panther until I opened this one up and took it out the box. So, y'all let me know what y'all think about both of them. 
Once again, it's your boy Red Milwaukee 414 coming back at it again straight from Snicker S Color Line. Appreciate you guys watching. I truly do. Appreciate all the new subscribers that have uh, you know subscribed to the channel. And if you haven't subscribed yet, I mean, stop playing. Make sure you guys go ahead and just hit that button, subscribe to the channel. Uh, also, as well, after you hit the subscribe button, make sure you guys go ahead and hit that notification bell for all the new videos that I post when they post so you guys will get notified about when they are uploaded and you guys can check them out. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and sign out and I'm gonna...